A Wabash Valley retail business has made this Christmas shopping season its last. As New Sense Brittany Earl reports, it's a familiar place, owned and operated by a familiar face. But the time to close has come. The Furniture Gallery. It's been a staple among the Wabash Valley for 15 years. A store that furnishes family rooms, turning a house into a home. And you may recall this friendly face. And for the next 10 days, I have personally ordered all prices to be dropped to my a face you often saw across the valley's TV screen. To but today, Kim Worland, owner of the Furniture Gallery, makes one last appearance. There's some doors I want to open, and in order to open the doors, I've got to close these doors. On Monday, December 23rd, Kim and her husband, Jim, locked the doors and closed up shop. I can't express enough how many friends and the fun and the opportunities, and I've got to be part of your home, um, and part of your backyard with Kevin. I mean, I've had a grand time. It's been 15 years here at this location, and I'm really done. There's a lot of reasons. There's a, I have a list of reasons of why. Mainly, it's just time. I'm in excellent health. I'm at a really good age to do a lot of more things. There's so many things I want to do. Um, I'll be honest with you, the economy's been tough, but that's not why I'm closing. Um, it's just time. It's just, you know, my family needs me, and there's just things I want to do. Prompting Kim to close one chapter of life so she can start another. <laughs> I don't have a first clue what I'm going to do. Not the first clue. Um, I'm staying here. This is my home. I'm going to stay in the Wabash Valley for sure. What I do um, beginning today, December 26th, I don't have a clue, but I know it'll be a good one. Kim and Jim took one last stroll through the store to say goodbye, and then they turned out the lights for the last time. For News 10, I'm Brittany Earl. Kim says as of right now, she is preparing to liquidate the building for sale. She will reopen the doors on January 1st. She says when the last piece of furniture is gone, she's locking the doors for good. The property and building are for sale.